lot of people have attachment to their artwork, but the thing about glass is we break pieces all the time, every day. It just happens, it's, it's part of it. If we break a piece or if something happens in the annealing cycle and it blows up, we take all of those shards of glass and put it back into our buckets and then recycle it again. People want to buy recycle because they know that it means something better. It's a little bit heavier and it's a little bit thicker and they like that. What I was starting to see is that terrariums were becoming popular again. There's really nobody else doing terrariums out here. And I just started filling them with spider plants, orchids, everything I could think of. Um, and I just wanted to see how they grew. And the more I started doing this, the more I realized the, the plants that I had naturally picked were air cleaning plants. So mantra glass is really formed around the idea of sustainable principles and, and processes. Be able to connect with the state of Colorado and do something that kind of propels art forward, I think is really important to me. Can a piece of glass be something more than a pretty piece that sits somewhere? You know, can it have function? Can it be valuable to somebody? Can it do something?